Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So once again, Microsoft is updating its Defender definitions to protect against Windows installation image malware. And Microsoft does this at least once a month. And this is the definitions that are pre-built into the actual ISO image files. Now, as you may well know, the first hours of a newly installed Windows installation can leave the system vulnerable because of a Microsoft Defender protection gap. And this is because the OS installation images may contain outdated anti-malware software definitions. And obviously this means that the devices on which these um, installations are made are then inadequately protected until they receive the first anti-malware software update. So Microsoft updates the ISO definitions almost now on a monthly basis, which I actually think is a move in the right direction, as I have mentioned previously. Now, if we just head to the change log and the release notes for this, and these are obviously the supported versions, Windows 11, Windows 10, Server 2022, 2019, and 2016. And if we head down to the security intelligence version, and the Defender Package version, which will be the same. The Security Intelligence Update rolled out on the 16th. So that was just a couple of days ago. Today, we find ourselves on the 23rd of June. So although it's not fully up to date, it is, it is at least better than being a month or so old, the definitions. Here are the different sizes for the package size. And if you want to get your hands on that, yeah, the download links. I'll leave this page linked in the description. And if we head over to Microsoft Defender and we have a look at our protection updates today at the time of posting this video, I'm already on 1431.162 where the ISO definitions are on 0.54. So although not fully up to date, just a couple of days old at post in this video so I think that's a move in the right direction just plug in that protection gap for those ISO image files so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one